All right, check this out. This is magic. You put in this prompt that says write a skin type quiz with five questions and four outcomes and show the results. You click submit. This is OpenAI's playground. And give it a second to calculate. And it's going to spit out questions for a skin type quiz. And you can basically write a quiz in, it took me 15 minutes to do this this morning. And for reference, I've been doing this for 11 years. I co-founded the very first lead gen quiz builder back in 2012. So we've built tens of thousands, hundreds of thousands of quizzes. And this is the biggest game changer I have seen in an entire decade. So it shows you the answer key down here, shows you the questions, and that's it. But this is not the entire quiz. This is just one of the building blocks. And so I want to show you how to put these building blocks together to make an actual quiz inside of Interact, because that's how you make this actually work to your benefit. Now, not everything's going to be perfect with OpenAI. Sometimes it's going to have little quirks, like all of the answers here are rarely, sometimes often and very often. That's not really a great quiz. So you have to might maybe modify that a bit. But in here, I have the building blocks. So the first thing is the quiz title. So you ask the chat GPT or the OpenAI Playground, write a skin type quiz title, it spits this out. And then here's what it looks like in the interface. And you put that into Interact. So here's Interact, where you can actually make it styled and interactive and all that kind of good stuff. Next thing is the description for the quiz. Again, I ask the chat GPT or the open AI, why should I take this skin type quiz in 30 words? You have to st stipulate the words. And I'm using the playground in open AI because I prefer this interface. It's the same thing as chat GPT. So either way, whatever you prefer. And it puts this out. Then I do the questions, which is what I just showed you here. Then I do each of the outcomes. And I'm skipping through this because I, I obviously like did this already and I want to show you what the end product looks like. But for the outcomes, you ask them to describe what dry skin is and how I can take care of it. It gives you a description there. You put that into the results for Interact, which looks like this. And then here's what the questions look like in Interact. And then you can set up the scoring in Interact so it connects the answer choices to the results. Then you set up your lead gen, which has a form connects to Clavio, and you can segment based on which outcome someone gets on the quiz and individual questions. Then you publish, and you're all done with the quiz. You put it into a blog, or you can set it up as a pop-up or an announcement bar on a website. In this case, I have it in this blog post in WordPress embedded, so I'll just show you what it looks like. And here it is, once it loads in, give it a second. It will load in right here, and I'll be able to actually take the quiz on my WordPress blog, which is crazy. <laughs> like It's just right here. This is all done with OpenAI. All the text on this is done in OpenAI. I just proofread it a little bit to make sure there was nothing funky or that sounded off or whatever, and here it is. Even this opt-in form was written using OpenAI. And again, I have all the prompts for that on here of like what to ask it in order to get your exact phrasing, like the right, the right framework for it. Cause you do have to prompt it correctly in order to give you what you want. But then once you do, this is the game changer. This is the biggest innovation that I have ever seen when it comes to writing quizzes. It allows you to create the copy for it almost instantly and then have it be in the quiz load it into interact launch it now it's just as easy to launch a lead generation quiz as it is to do any sort of pop-up or anything so this is how to build a quiz using open ai chat gpt whichever one you prefer